How's it going everybody? Gmurf here. I'm going to talk about what's coming to Dead by Daylight in Chapter 14, Curse Legacy. The new killer is called the Oni. His power is Yamaoka's Wrath, which allows you to absorb blood orbs from injured survivors to fill your power gauge. Once it's full, you activate Blood Fury, which comes with two parts. The first part is Demon Dash, grants the ability to cover great distances with additional movement speed. It's very similar to Hillbilly's Chainsaw. And the second part is Demon Strike. Press and hold attack in the direction you are facing for an extended lunge, and you'll put healthy survivors in dying states. Okay, I'm gonna go over the killer's perks. First one is Zanshin Tactics. The aura of all pallets and vault locations are revealed to you within 24 meters. After damaging a survivor, the perk becomes inactive for 40 seconds. All right, the second perk is called Blood Echo. When hooking a survivor, all other injured survivors suffer the hemorrhage status effect until healed and are exhausted for 45 seconds. And the third perk is called Nemesis. When a survivor blinds or stuns you using a pallet or locker, they become your obsession. Anytime a new survivor becomes your obsession, they are affected by the oblivious status effect for 40 seconds, and their aura is shown to you for 4 seconds. Okay, now we're going to look at the new survivor, Yui Kimura. I hope I didn't butcher that. Her first perk is called Lucky Break. Lucky Break activates anytime you are injured. You won't leave blood trails for a total of 120 seconds. Lucky Break is permanently deactivated for the remainder of the trial once the total duration has elapsed. Right, our second perk is called Any Means Necessary. Press and hold the active ability button for 3 seconds while standing beside a dropped pallet to reset it to its upright position. Any Means Necessary has a cooldown of 160 seconds. And her last perk is called Breakout. When within 6 meters of a carry survivor, you gain haste status effect, moving at 5% increased speed, and a carry survivor's wiggle speed is also increased by 20%. Thanks everybody for watching, uh, I just want to make this nice and short, so get this video out as quick as possible. Uh, please like and subscribe if you like the video, leave a like. And I will see you next time. Peace.